This place is great, really comfortable. I'm just gonna get settled in. Time to move on, get on with my life. Yes, absolutely. said it was a long time ago let it go seriously Definitely more my style than Panama, or Hoboken, I guess. No, if I'm honest, I just got kind of bored of boozing. I mean, once in a while, but not all the time. You're right, it wasn't doing me any favors. Maybe I'd lost my self-respect, but it's back. I'm excited, really. I really needed a new start. I think you're right. I think I am gonna like it here. It certainly... It certainly ain't New Jersey. It's my new life. Just like you said. Listen, if you think I can still do a job, what have I got to lose? Apart from the weight. Very funny. Ha ha. Yes, that is a fake laugh, you jerk. So I guess I'd become what they wanted me to be. A killer. Some rent-a-clown with a gun who puts holes in other bad guys. Well, that's what they had paid for, so in the end, that's what they got. Say what you want about Americans, but we understand capitalism. You buy yourself a product and you get what you pay for. And these chumps had paid for some angry gringo without the sensibilities to know right from wrong. Here I was, about to execute this poor bastard like some dime store angel of death. And I realized they were correct. I wouldn't know right from wrong if one of them was helping the poor and the other was banging my sister.
I'd arrived in Sao Paulo a few weeks before. I was working a protection detail for the kind of people who need protection in a town like this. And what kind of town was this? One where I didn't speak the language and they didn't water down their drinks. So for now, we seem to get along just fine. Of course, that was about to change. Hey, brother. Hey. How's the cocktail? Scotch. I never mix my drinks. Yeah, well, at least not on duty. Something like that. Man, that favela is big. Yep. Nothing like the view of extreme poverty to make a penthouse cocktail party really swing. I guess they call it trickle-down economics. <laughs> That's funny. It's supposed to be a charity thing. Drink and give money. I don't know. Something for the kids. Hey, listen, man. We better look lively. This place is a nightmare. They just got cowboys running security downstairs. Something... ...rotten in the air. That didn't mean much. There was always something rotten in the air. The family we were protecting were local celebrities, rich parasites with delusions of humanity. The kind of people who end up in glossy magazines or body bags, depending on how their luck runs. So where are they all? I see Rodrigo over there talking to that guy. Yeah, I don't know him. That guy next to him. He's some kind of cop. Uh, I think, I'm not sure. Serious though. Big end cop, anti-gang sort of thing. I can't remember his name. So who's this guy? That guy's a plastic surgeon or some kind of surgeon. Uh, tummy tucks and cock implants. <laughs> Look at Marcel. Still dances like a fool. Guess that's what a European education and a coke habit will do for Ricky Martin look alike. <laughs> that's very funny, Max. Oh, excuse me. I was mostly working for Rodrigo Branco, a local businessman. Built things, did some charity, had things named after him, won awards, owned things, people. One of the trophies he had won was his wife, Fabiana. She was hot and wanted to be dangerous. Some good genes trying to fight their way out of a cesspit. She'd married well and was now at leisure to regret her good fortune. They got along as well as any rich workaholic and his younger airhead wife tend to get along. They mostly ignored each other. She spent a lot of time with his cokehead younger brother, Marcello. He was a good time guy if your idea of a good time was an expensive suit, a bottle of champagne, and nothing between the ears. The middle brother, Victor, had just walked in. He was a local politician. Guy was smoother than an oil slick on an iceberg and about as toxic. The rest of the crowd, I didn't know, but I could imagine the types. People who know if they drink enough, they won't have to feel guilty about their good fortune. Suddenly, things turned real ugly. Felt like our hangovers arrived right on cue. Pass off! What was that? I don't know what the fuck that was. Let's go. Things had gone Shit. from fine to fucked up in about a second. And now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. You got this floor? Sure. Right. Look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about. Trophy wife or not. I'd said I would protect the girl. Olá malta, sejam muito bem-vindos a mais um vídeo aqui neste fantástico canal. Sim, estamos com o Max Payne 3 e malta tem, tem a assinatura da Rockstar. Um, do que eu sei, malta, esta franquia não foi criada pela Rockstar, mas a Rockstar apoderou-se dos seus direitos e criou este Max Payne 3. Malta, é um jogo que eu joguei no passado na, na consola. Uh, tive a oportunidade de comprar este jogo na Steam, estava a um preço bastante acessível, estamos a jogar no PC e malta, espero contar com o teu likezinho aí a apoiar esta série, por isso, bora daí, vamos continuar 
Uh, estamos no primeiro capítulo. Este jogo é todo marado, malta. Uh, mas ok, bora lá então. Vamos continuar, ok? Uh, isto teve uma intro do caraças, malta. Teve uma intro do caraças. Bora. Voltar. Bora. Essa cena, malta, do slow motion, se vocês se recordam, Matrix, não é? Tudo como se... That was the boss lady. Only this time she wasn't calling for more vodka in her Cosmo. Espera aí, três armas tens. Ok. Pronto, nós estávamos aqui nesta festa e apareceram estes gajos, não é? Feitos brutamontes. She was out on one of the balconies, and I hoped not about to be thrown off it. Espetáculo. Pois tem esta cena slow motion, um pouco estilo Red Dead Redemption 2, não é? A cena dos disparos, está muito fixe. Tranquila. Nós cuidamos disso. Nice work. Hey, you need a hand? No, you. Who the hell's Rodrigo? I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah. Somebody's gotta go find him. Yeah, it's trick arm. Bora lá então. Está tudo sob controle agora. Fica tranquilo. Malta, não tens mapa aqui a seguir a história. Está a andar. I imagine the elevator door is opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Where's Bronco? Oh, oh. Como é que eu me baixo? Caraças, não é que eu tentar procurar essa tecla? Não, 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 não. Como é que eu me baixo? Ok, acho que é ok, é X, X, X. E olha, estão a ver a cena de, de, de se partir tudo. Brutal. Ok, vamos continuando. Só sangue, mano. Como é que se carrega a arma? Ah, vamos com esta já. Caçadeira. Ok, bora. E que cena, meu! Foda-se! A sério? Oh, oh! Este ainda parece mais fixe, caralho. É para aqui? It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Yeah, é um jogo que ele fala com ele próprio, estão a ver? E se vocês conhecem quem é a voz está a falar, é do ator de 24 horas. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to Sério? work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. Os cenas, os cenas dos tiros estão, estão espetaculares, malta. Isso é mesmo. O Max Payne, para quem conhece Max Payne, o Max Payne, o primeiro jogo Max Payne, tinha este efeito de slow motion. Uh... Olha este tiro, boom! Espetáculo. Tinha esta cena de slow motion. Depois, entretanto, apareceu também o Entro de Matrix, que tinha a mesma cena, estão a perceber? Bora carregar, não é? Bora. Another parking lot rattling with gunfire. Was I too late? Oh, my God. 
That's worse. E Vito! Sin! Oh, oh, oh! Cabrón. Uno murió. Serio. É força. Pois tem essas cenas estas que é de cima, estão a ver? Yeah, essas cenas estão brutais, essas partes slow motion. Está feito? Calma, calma, calma. Será que esta arma ficou sem tiros? Ah, não tem tiros. Bora lá. Oh, oh! Pera, 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 pera. Olhem só para isto. Brutal. Ok? Que cena, não é assim um tiro você assim a queimar roupa? Você acha que tem o direito de matar as pessoas a sangue frio, Becker? Cala a boca, cuzão! Continua dando multas! Não ponha o nariz onde não é chamado! Vamos! Ah, ajuda, cara! Chama uma ambulância! Vamos! Me ajuda! Ajuda! Oh, fuck! Você fez bem, Max! Você diz isso! Não olha tão bem! Hey, what could be better, huh? The good guys are reunited, and the Commando Sombra are dead. I guess. So who's this guy? I don't know. Some kind of cop. Different branch of the police. Not Ufe, but uh, normal cops. I don't know about this stuff. Politics. Everywhere politics. Shit, Max, you look kind of beat up. Let's get this lot home, and then I'll, I'll get you home too. Come on. Time for some R and R. The only way I knew how. So is ready for bed. <laughs> A couple of days later, it was back to work. Ferrying the boss's broad and his dipshit of a brother out for the night so they could recover from their brush with mortality. Then again, what did I expect? These were the kind of people who went to nightclubs in helicopters. Fabiana had brought her sister along, presumably so she could show off just how rich and empty her life was. And boy, was she about to learn the meaning of rich and empty. Max! Max! I was speaking to you! Sorry, what was that? Oh, I was saying we get into a lot of scrapes, man. <laughs> well, we're still here. Hey! Thanks to you, Max. I owe you my life. Boom. It wasn't just him, huh, baby? Oh, yes, Marcel. I'm sure you did a lot to save everyone. <laughs> you were probably worried about getting blood on your stash. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> Thank you, Max. I don't know what I would do without my sister. Mmm! Spend even more time doing something useful. <laughs> 
<laughs> you know she works in the favela. She's the good sister. Oh, shut up. <laughs> what did you hear, Faba? More bodies turned up or people went missing. But it's horrifying. Did someone say Buzz Q? Hey. I'm just kidding. But it is a cold town, man. <laughs> hey, here we are. <laughs> I love this view. It's a real chill place to hang, you know? Do a little business, have some fun. I need it too. I've been working far too hard. Like a whore during Fleetchy Weeky, as my roommate used to say. <laughs> you like that, Max? That's pretty funny. This kind of place made me want to puke. I needed a real drink to deal with the electronic music and the robotic people. Fucking movie from a fucking slum. The act's cool with me. What's that? Nothing. Say, Max, you're a man of the world. What do you fucking do it, man? About what? What do you do about life? Look at me, I'm standing in a nightclub. Listening to music I can't stand. I'm 5,000 miles from home. I'm armed and I'm drinking. You don't want to listen to advice from me, amigo. <laughs> oh, Max, I love you, man. You're fucking real, you know? Oh, shit. People. Fuck them. People get me wrong. I think... I think I love a wrong woman. Oh, excuse me. Fabio! Fabio! Oh, ah, my nigga! <laughs> Thank God he has left. A minute more of his drivel and I would have had to put a bullet in him myself. It soon turned out I wasn't the only one. Ok, estamos de volta em ação. Ok, 
Caralho. Rápido. Pimba. Que é, que é tipo de desgraça, malta, uma das... Yeah. Uh, uma das cenas que o jogo tem é as cutscenes são enormes, malta. São enormes. Eu sabia que se eu não chegar à garota rápido, eles iriam sair deste lugar com qualquer... As portas foram fechadas. I didn't need my Portuguese for beginners phrase book to work out what was going on. The guy making the noise was the boss. He was sending them around to cut me off from the okay, other side. Up here. And sure enough, a few seconds later, I had some company on the dance floor. Ah, yeah, ok, boa. Bora. Oh, ah, estás aí, já te topei. Está frustrado. Ok, este carregar-me. Bora! Está livre! Como é que apanhar munições? É verdade! Ah não, só temos a pistola! Time was a luxury I couldn't afford. Brutal, meu, brutal. Simplesmente brutal. Bora, vamos continuar. Não é bom, bro. Não é bom. Alguns caras pegaram Giovanna e Fabiana. O que? Jesus, Max, eu estou no caminho. Não, não, não. Estou no chopper. Nós precisamos de uma saída daqui. Eu vou procurar as garotas. Assim, nem continuam a ser os brasileiros. Foda-se outra vez. Oh, shit. E altamente mata a passar pelo vidro. A nível de efeitos, o outro está espetacular para a altura que era. Olha, curtem. Pum! Acho que foi no olho. Nice! Let's go! Há de ser para aqui, não é? Para. Hum, onde é que estamos? Olha lá, três portas. Para que lado será? Sure. Yeah, I'm from Steele, North Dakota, just outside of Bismarck. Anders Stetling. 
This is some place, huh? They, they told me it was a little fresh, but I wasn't expecting things to be quite like this. No? No, see, I've, I've seen things. I was a cop for 25 years. I've seen men run over by combines. I've seen husbands who just ate their wives, but a gunfight at a disco? <laughs> you were a cop? Yeah, just retired. Oh, what a life that was. And it gave me the money to raise a family. Oh, I got a girl at college in Wisconsin and a boy who's playing football for Minnesota State. You want to see their picture? No, no, that's all right. Oh. Sounds nice. Listen, you stay in here. Don't be a hero. Oh, I won't. I'm retired. <laughs> Happy I'm healthy ex-cop. Give me a break. Whatever the hell they were arguing about. It's time for me to add my two cents. They were still alive at least. This crew was starting to look a lot like friends of the gate crashers at last week's party. These guys had some real issues with the Broncos. They were back to finish Sério? the job. I figured it was time to start oh. the mine. Mostra a cabecinha. Ela já foste. <risos> Curtiram o movimento do gajo. Não morreu. Ah, pum. Eles vieram daqui. E para aí temos aqui a Uzi. Ok, temos uma arma nova, boa. Temos com o Uzi, ok. This wasn't the time to be second guessing myself. I had to hurry or I'd lose them. Ah, caralho. Cala a boca, sua puta! Como é que nós podemos subir? They were headed for the helicopter pad. I had to get to the roof before Giovanna and Fabiana left on a one-way flight. Sério? This was going to be a bad idea, but in the continued absence of any good ones, I decided to go with it. What a view. I guess my time in Sao Paulo wasn't quite the paid holiday in the sun I'd been promised. At least I was getting shot at by a bit of class of psychopath. These guys weren't messing around. This place was like Baghdad with G-strings. A couple of more seconds and I'd have given some poor street cleaner a crappy start to his day. Now, I had a ride to catch. Calma, 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 calma. Também já foi. Também já foi. Oh, 
Oh, oh, chao, que regue rápido, rápido. Rápido. Ok. No acredito. Ai, shit, 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 shit. Vai lá tentar outra vez. Caraças. Oh, oh, mais outro. Come on, rapid, rapid, rapid. Oh, 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 oh. Sério? Hã? Shit, shit, shit. Rap, 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 rap. Já foi. Oh, oh, isso é uma bazuca. Oh, 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 oh. Que que cena, meu. <risos> Aí, é sério. Outra vez. O que é que eu tenho que matar? Espera aí. É o gajo da bazuca, Richard? Não, não. Tu tens é que chutar isto. Quem está a chutar? Ai, isso é. Outra vez? Caralho, nós. Foda-se. Não estava a entender. Tínhamos que chutar a disparar. Contra a bazuca. There was a goddamn army of these goons. Clearly, somebody wanted these girls bad. Or maybe they just assumed the Bronco security team consisted of more than a drunk American has been and a Brazilian never was who should have paid more attention in flying school. Either way, I needed to find Giovanna before they did. Ok, malta, nós vamos chegar por aqui. Espero que tenhas gostado deste primeiro episódio. Uh, fizemos, acabámos de fazer... Já fiz, estamos no segundo capítulo. Uh, malta, é um jogo com, uma, com boa ação. Isto acaba quase por ser um filme. O jogo tem muitas cutscenes. E uma coisa que fiz que este jogo tem é que... Tu não te apercebes. Tá, estás a perceber? E as cutscenes são com os mesmos gráficos que o jogo tem. O que é muito fixe. E isto é, de facto, uma obra da Rockstar. Uh, não foi a Rockstar que criou este jogo, mas de facto está um jogo espetacular. E, por que não, um Max Payne 4. Ok? Malta, espero que tenhas gostado. Aquele like maravilhoso. Ajuda a fortalecer o canal. Já sabes, se gostares do conteúdo, deixa aquele like. Subscreve o canal também. Está na descrição as minhas parcerias. Passa por lá e também, se quiseres, podes ajudar o canal de alguma forma através de donations. Vou-me embora. Espero que tenhas gostado e até o um próximo vídeo. Fui! Adiós!